walk to the waterfront promenade. So one really cool thing about Hong Kong is that they will give you a 100 Hong Kong dollar voucher. Um, so when you get into the station, you can go to B2 and they might direct you up to G GTM. GTM. Um, and then you show them your passport and you'll get a little slip to say when uh, your stay expires. So as a British citizen, I get six months in Hong Kong. Um, and then they give you a little thing, then you can scan it and you can redeem that money whilst you're in Hong Kong. So free money, don't forget to do it. wasn't too far from our hotel near Jordan Station, so we took a leisurely walk there, stopping for Hong Kong's famous egg bubble waffles on the way. So we just decided to get a waffle, two waffles, and it was $80. Looks really yummy. So I got the waffle with chocolate ice cream. It's so big, I don't know how I'm going to eat it. It's so good, but it's very messy. so we didn't splash out on a hotel but let us show you our home for today okay. this is our huge bed our huge double bed double king size there's <laughs> huge windows overlooking the ocean so beautiful yes <laughs> this is our master bathroom an amazing sink we could bathe in this is so big and then the toilet shower incredible now that was on 0.5 zoom, so it looks more spacious than it is. Let me put it on real size so you get a better idea. It looks pretty big on camera, but this bed, I can assure you, is not big. I'm not big and I can touch every wall. <laughs> In preparation for coming to Hong Kong, we thought we should get a Hong Kong SIM card because our Chinese SIM cards won't work in Hong Kong. So, you got that one on Taobao? This is a um, travel SIM card, you can get it from Taobao. Um, we will stay here for like four days, including Hong Kong and Macau. You can use this one for both. So, um, I got it from Taobao and it, it's only like 30 RMB for four days. Each day you will have like three gigabyte data, which will definitely enough for your you know, daily use. Um, and then we got um, Octopus card, which is like 
200 Hong Kong dollar per one. Um, you know, it's only like 150 Hong Kong dollar you can use, 50 Hong Kong dollar for deposit. When you don't want it anymore, you can return it. If it's within like three months and less than five times use, then you have to pay 11 Hong Kong dollar service charge. Otherwise, you don't have to pay. Um, I think that's a good deal. So you don't have to wait for the queue to get in the bus or like metro. Mm -hmm. It's so convenient. Yeah. yeah, these you can get at the train station when you come into Hong Kong. However, you can't pay by cash. Yes. So we only had Hong a Kong thousand, cash. Yeah, yeah, a thousand dollar note, dollar note, which we couldn't break. Yeah. So we went to just a metro station and asked at the counter. Mm -hmm. And you can use English or Cantonese. Mm -hmm. They don't really understand Mandarin, but pretty much everyone will understand English. Yeah. So just use English, don't worry about language barriers, um, and they're super friendly. Yeah, they have a self-buying machine for the Octopus card, but the machine doesn't take cash. Mm -hmm. So you can u only use like WeChat Pay, Alipay, some other like online payments. Um, it doesn't help you to break down the, the big notes, so yeah. you should go to yeah. like normal metro station, just break it down, go to like service counter, ask them to help you. Yeah, and don't worry about it having $150 on it. $150 in Hong Kong dollars is like... 130 Yeah, 130 like 15 pound, 15 GBP. Yeah. So it's not a lot of money, and you can use your Oyster cards in some restaurants, fast food chains, 7-Eleven, um, the place that we just got waffles from, the bubble waffles, yeah. the egg waffles. You could use your Oyster, uh, your octopus card there, so don't worry about having too much money on the octopus card. You can use it in other places. When you return, you can get all your balance back, so mm -hmm. don't worry about it. We then headed to Jordan Station to explore Sim Sha Sui. Setting in, we set off to find a local cafe for some lunch. You wanna try? We're, we're in a traditional Hong Kongese cafe. We've ordered that special and I've ordered a drink. That was eighty eight dollars. Ice coffee. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Pineapple juice. Ice coffee. Ice coffee. Cheers. Cheers. Outside my window is everything. Next, we got the metro to Prince Edward Station to check out the market. It's been ringing all day long. Behind these clouds, I know the sun will be. But today's raining, so be patient with me. I'll be right, somehow I must be. Somewhere the sky is blue.
and have stumbled upon a bird garden. Inside my room, the heat's like a warm embrace. My bed feels like heaven. I lose track of time and space. flower markets we headed to Goldfish Street. Every shop on the street is in an aquarium selling fish. to a local restaurant near our Airbnb. It was then time to call it a night. 